The University of California San Diego is home to the world's largest outdoor earthquake simulator. The facility, also known as ShakeTable, is undergoing a major upgrade thanks to a $16.3 million grant from the National Science Foundation. Over the years, researchers have tested many structures there. Full-scale high-res buildings, wind turbines, bridge columns, and more. When the upgrade is complete, experiments will provide more data than ever and lead to safer buildings and infrastructures. Here is Principal Investigator Joel Conte talking about why the upgrade is important and what impact it will have. It will save a large number of, of, of human lives. And just thinking about this is, is, a, is a very you know, exciting uh, to have upgraded that shake table to six degree of freedom. Well, the most exciting thing is uh, that it will have the ability to move in six directions, so to speak. So translation, east, west, north, south, up and down. And like when you are in an airplane, you know, the rotation are important too. Like if you're in an airplane, you have the roll, one wings goes down, the other one goes up. And then you have the pitch, the nose of the airplane goes down, the tail goes up or vice versa. And then the yaw, the airplane turns to the left or to the right. Now, with the one degree of freedom for, for about f for 15 years, we, we did significant landmark tests, which had impact in the research and then found all its way into the design code. And of course, with a, an immediate impact into the future, you know, the loss of life into the future. So, so now that we just dropped the platen. This is a major, major milestone because from now on that platen, once we reconnect everything and we check, you know, ca uh, customize and, and fine tune the, the control system, it will be able to now reproduce much more realistic ground motions. It will produce a big jump in the, in the knowledge of uh, how building responds and bridges and civil infrastructure to earthquakes and again, it will, that research will find its way to the design code and, and improve significantly the, the, the aspect of the design code, uh, the realistic treatment of, of, of earthquakes in designing structures to resisting them. In the past, you know, one of the major goal was to prevent civil infrastructure from f falling, collapsing and killing people. And now we're doing a pretty good job with this we would like to have what is called a resilient uh, you know, built environment so that structures, especially critical structures, can go back into, uh, into action you know, very soon after the earthquakes. And of course, the best way to guide the development of this system and validate them is, is to, to, to bring the most realistic earthquake excitation at large scale, which is what this table will be able to achieve. The Shake Table is set to reopen in fall of 2021.